Hi guys, how you going? Um, no, I'm not bleeding. Just so you know, it's paint, it's dry. I'm a crafter. We know we we know how it goes. Um, <laughs> how's everyone going? Good. Good. Let's get into it. We have some unbaggings. Um, this one I'm fairly confident I know what it is and where it come from. That one I've got no clue. I have just sat here and went through my entire email list and I can't find where it's come from or what it could possibly be. It's not from AliExpress. I know that much. So we'll leave that until last. We'll leave that second. This one. This one feels fairly heavy. So let's get stuck into it. Where's my little knife? Oh Jesus, I'm going to knock everything down. You've got no idea the mess that's over there. Trust me, you don't want to know. I don't want to know. Righto. That away. Hmm. Hmm. It is the one. Now, this came a little bit squished. Um, this one is from AliExpress. It is from the Diamond Painting Factory store. That is what it is called. So we have some crinkles there. See the Kreningles? We got Kreningles. And that is what it should look like. Can we focus on that somehow? Oh look, I'll just wait until I'm into it. Okie dokie. This should be a 45 by 60 centimetre. I'll keep that bag because that's going to have to go back in there. So I'm not too worried about those crinkles because we have a poured glue canvas. Look, hello. So we have a basic toolkit, no baggies. So we've just got a pen, plate of wax. I'll try and get that shadow out of there. Pen, plate of wax and a normal green bow. They can go up there, don't need them. Okay, so that. Whoop. Look. Dumbass, take it out of the bag. Oh, already in baggies. Hello. So that is what it should be. If I can hold it still and get the camera. It's a lantern. It's a lantern with moths, not butterflies, moths. So we have 25 colors. Why is that so wide? So with this, we've got the number of drills. We've got the symbols. So they use one through nine and then A through T. That would be the DMC codes. That would be how many? No, that'd be how many? That'd be how many? What? What's this number? Those numbers aren't right. Why are they there? And what the hell are these? Are they weights? And what's the whole one thing? Because they're how many bags I'm meant to have. Holy shit, I'm meant to have 16 bags. I was gonna, I need to start wearing my glasses when I'm doing this. I was gonna say, why, why have they got B for a number of bags, but it's actually an eight? Never mind. So we have a lot of purples, 
A lot of purples, a lot of pinks. They're all laid out nicely so you can see. Ta-da! Get that back in. You can see it when I put it in the camera view. There you go. Let's have a look at this canvas. You know, without all those drills, it's actually quite light. So, as you can see, the back of the canvas is quite crinkled. I'm not stressing because it's poured glue kit, which means it should be fine. All right. That is quite pretty. I should have been a size bigger, but that is quite pretty. Um, once I... Let's have a look at that for a start. Okay, that bubble there is not in the glue. That is just in the plastic from how it's been folded and wrapped and packaged and all that sort of fun jazz. So that is that one. So we've got, I don't know what sort of flowers they are, but they're pretty when you can see them. Um, drill field. Mm -hmm. They've got training circles. Training circles, if you can see that. Where's a white bit? Training circles. Symbols are clear. Says a woman that just mistook an eight for a B. Um, <laughs> but the symbols are clear. I can see that much. So it is around. It does have training circles. That is a letdown. So Diamond Painting Factory Store. I'm not impressed. I won't order from them again. Not happy. Um, between how it's been shipped to the training circles, I'm not happy. Um, let's check out. Where's a dark colour? There is no black. Wait, yes there is. 16. Maybe that's a deep dark brown. 16 is... No. Apparently that's 3371. Or 1848. Depending on how you want to read this bloody stupid thing. No, 3371. So I'm guessing that is... A deep dark brown um, but from what I can see there's no rubbish they're nice round drills no tags nothing like that but we all know that we can sit here and look I'm not even in camera we can sit here and go, hey, those drills look good, and then we start working on them, and they're absolute garbage. But from what I can see, like I said, I haven't got the glasses on. I haven't even got them in here. I'll be here somewhere. Um, excuse me. Oh. They look nice, and... Um, let me find a light colour. They look pretty good. There does not seem to be any garbage in there at all. So, yeah. So there's that one. So that's from Diamond Painting Factory Store. It is around a 45 by 60 with, what did I say, 20, 25 colours. Overall outlook at the moment is dismal. Um, 
So that'll probably sit in the cupboard for another 12 months before we see that again. Um, right, now onto the one where I don't know where it's coming from. Just gonna roll you up gently. Sit you to the side. Onto the mystery one. What do you reckon? 30 centimetres wide? I've got a feeling it's from like... Um, one of those online stores like... Um, you know, that one. But, oh, what are they called? The RF... R, RF something or other? Nothing in there? Nothing in there. Um... It's made in China. I can tell you that much. That's about it. Oh, no, 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 no. Can I open up without using the knife? I can. We got poor glue. I had a feeling this is the tiger. And if it is, I know where I got it from, but I can't remember. Um, I'll put it in the description down below. Um, if you're overly curious, go and have a look. So, this has come all crinuncled as well. This canvas is a lot thicker than the last one. It is the tiger. Um... Where did I get this from? Complete mind blank. Anyway, let's take this out first. I was only looking at this kit the other night online and I thought, now, I'm sure I ordered that. So, comes with two tool kits. No baggies. Just single pen, plates of wax and a boat. No multi-places. Just single placer. These are the drills that usually when they come like this with the silver means they're pretty good drills. I've never had bad drills come out of these ones. Um, this is also around. So we have a Zatiga. Oh, he's very pretty. He is very handsome. Um, I do know where I got this from. I will have to look at it up because it will be in my phone somewhere 24 colors he is very nice he is very nice um so you've got i'll turn him sideways so you can see all of him all at once so there he is that way and for those, there is that one. So he's very nice, very pretty. Um, no training circles on this, which is good. Very bright colours, actually, on the canvas. I'm just hoping he turns out as well as he looks here. Let's have a look at the drills. Just move them up for a second. Actually, let's turn them over. You can see how crinkled that kid is. Once again, I'm not worried. It actually looks like there's been something sat on there that's round because it's on every where it's been folded. So something's been sat on it. Come back. Come back. Right. 
I'm just gonna bring it down a little bit. Meow. Yeah. Okay. And I'm gonna go this way. So here are your colours. And they are very bright, very nice colours. A few greys and that, but of course these two bags of that. Um, actually, five. Hold on, I just want to see something, sorry. Five is a T. Oh no, that's alright. I thought, don't tell me that's the white, but it's not. Nice purple. Beautiful blues. Very nice red. A few browns. Nice pinks. Purple colours. We've got a couple of stowaways there. I thought they'd be more white. Apparently not. That actually looks like. No, it's not. I thought that looked like a glow in the dark drill, but it's not. I'm just double checking. I'm just going to hold it to that light. I very highly doubt it is, but you got to check these things, right? Look at some drills. There you go. Some pretty colours. No. Not glow in the dark, but I could have sworn that they were. Okay. Bring you back out. Yeah, oh, don't want to see that mess over there. Hold on. Okay, that is all I have for you today. I want to say the RFDS store, but RFDS in Australia is Royal Flying Doctor Service, and it's not RFDS. <laughs> I don't know. I'll put it in the description box down below. So, if you want to know, go to there. So, there he is again. Very regal looking, is that the word? Very proud tiger. Big old paw. Um, like I said, that would be... It is a 40 by 80 centimetre, I've just seen. But it still doesn't have the... This is why stores need to put their name on things. Because we get them and we order that much, we forget where we're ordering things from. Um, so it would help if there are stores out there watching this, if you put your logo or just simple writing saying where you got it from. There's nothing down here. There's absolutely nothing saying where this is from. Nothing. So guys, if you do have a store and you're watching this, put your logo somewhere. Even on the packaging is fine. Just a sticker on the packaging or something. Just so we know where where it's come from and what we're looking at it helps it really helps right oh guys well that is me done for tonight i will find where this has come from and i will put it in like i said in the description box and just can go down there and have a look i really hope these turn out as well as 
Sorry, I seen a naughty word. Ah. Uh, <laughs> whoops. Um. Sort of. It's very distracting. Because, for instance, when you're looking, like, look at his whiskers, but when you look close, like, my camera's going to go all, yeah, they are, get that light out of there, like, you can see the whiskers, but there's actually no spot on the whiskers for gems. It's just like a background colour. So I really hope that these turn out as well. As they look. Which I'm a bit worried about. See, so like that whisker. Where am I? Where am I? Where am I? That whisker there. There are diamond places all along there that aren't white. I don't know whether you can see it or not. Um, but we'll just have to have a look once we're done it. Um, this won't be my next one though. My next one will be an ever moment. It is the Lethal Angel one with the pur pink and purple skull. When I finally finish that dragon. I'll get to it. I will. I promise. Um, yeah, so it looks like they print the actual picture out. Or they do the picture and then they just put the drill symbols over the top where you put the drill and it just don't think it's quite going to make sense I could be wrong wouldn't be the first one so we'll just have to wait and see because surely you're not going to get whiskers that are that pretty um but like i said wait and see wait and see wait and see i'm just having a look like they've got the u symbol along here where he's got one of his eye eye whisker things coming out here um, and they've got the U symbol there. You can see the whisker, but they've got the U symbol there. But all in here is the U symbol as well, which is a blue. Which means that's going to cover that whisker. Capish. Same with down here. Hmm. We will have to wait and see. I'm just waiting. <laughs> I'm waiting for the name of this place to come to my mind and it's just not coming. Right, guys, I'm going to leave it there. I will go and find the name of this store um, and how much I paid and all the rest of the gear. Um, so I hope you are all having a good night, good morning, good day, good two o'clock in the morning if that's when you're watching it. Because let's face it, most of us can't sleep half the night and we just do our crafts. So, yeah. Right, I hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it. Bit disappointed on that last one. Bit worried about this one. But it's all good. We, we do these things so you don't have to. Um, and here I, <laughs> I said when I first started this channel, I'm not a reviewer. And here I am doing reviews. Um, I paid for these, by the way, with my own money. Nobody's paying me to do reviews. Um, so, yeah. If they wanted me to, I would be happy to review their channel. Ah, uh, their channel. 
the company, but I have had one company ask me so far. I'm not letting you know who it is just yet because I haven't ordered just yet, but I am going to um going to do a review for them because I have a good feeling about that company. So Right on guys, once again, I'm going. Um I just can't get over how beautiful he is. I just hope he looks that nice once I'm done. He is absolutely stunning. I just hope he looks that good when I'm done. He is really pretty. Right out, guys. That is me. I'm done. Like I said, I'm not worried about the crinkles. Poured glue. Not double-sided adhesive. It is poured glue, which means... If you do get something like this, flip it over, put a towel, put a towel over it, get a warm iron and just iron over the towel. Um, you don't want to iron straight onto the canvas. Uh, that could damage not only the canvas, but it could damage the glue. Um, so I would put a towel down over the top and just iron over the towel um, until you've got those wrinkles out. So uh, if under the mattress is working for you, that, that's fine too. Um, or even just hang them up if they're double-sided adhesive, I'd be very careful. You could end up doing more damage than good. Um, if you were to put them under your mattress, maybe, because you don't want them getting crinkled even further um, accidentally. But a warm iron should be right. Right. I'm going to shut up now and I'm going to go. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Right, I guess. I shall see you in my next video, which should be Wednesday. Hopefully I will be doing a What's in My Stash. Tomorrow's Tuesday here in Australia, so I should have enough time to get it done. Righto, guys, and hopefully I'll be able to give you an update on that one that I'm working on with um, the dragon from Diamond Art Club later on in the week. I might do another quick update on Friday. We'll see. Um... For the umpteenth time, I'm leaving it there. Night, guys. Bye.